today in this video we are going to discuss about the bio statistics in which we are going to see about the median already we have seen at the mean now in this video we are going to see the median of raw data discrete data and then grouped data so the median means center point naduvile irkindra pulli so in the road also there is a median which divides the road into two so similarly it divides the data into two that is the center point which we are going to see about the from the data that is called median so now we will be seeing about the raw data raw data means that is without representing any a correlation and other thing a simple data only one data is taken that is called raw data so we will be now uh, in that raw data we will be seeing about the median of even number and median of odd number even number means rate pade odd number utre pade that we are going to see how it is going to behave so first we will see the serial number 1 and then the variables are class variables are class or data or data this may be the weight of a fish which we are going to see and then yeah, it may be for 10 fishes 5 fishes or 20 fishes like that or it may be the mass of a student like that so first serial number very 40 grams say 40 grams and then 252 3 64 75 and then 578 6 also 78 and then 7 also 78 then 882 986 and then 1094 so the sum of uh, uh, here what we have to do uh, in this way the mid number is the formula is n plus 1 by 2 here the number of observations that is 10 10 numbers we have taken so 10 plus 1 by 2 is equal to 5.5. So that is the median number 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. 5. So this is in between 5 and 6. So when uh, uh, this is called even number, even number means uh, end in, in 8, 6, 10, 12 like that. So here it is ending in 10. That's why it is called even number. when it, uh, the uh, uh, midpoint is 10 plus uh, that is the median number is 10 plus 1 by 2 5.5 so it is it falls between 5 5 and 6 so what is the the 5 represents 78 the 5 represents 78 and then 6 represents 78 78 plus 78 divided by 2 is equal to 70 so the median is 78 so in the case, in this case the median is 78 next we will we will see what is the odd number suppose if it is odd number that is odd number means uh, 9 7 5 3 like that 11 13 so this is uh, odd number for odd number the same n plus 1 by 2 formula that is here it is 9 9 plus 1 by 2 sig to 5 so the the fifth one the fifth uh, data or variable or class is known as median so median here median is 78 so like that uh, we have to find out uh, the um, median median means 
the center and then the formula is formula which we are using is n plus 1 the number represents the serial number it is not the uh, frequency it is simply a number one fish weighs 40 52 64 like that the, this is each and every one it is separate for each and everything so that, that's why uh, this is called raw data next we are going to see about the discrete data this is median for raw data then we are going to see for median for discrete data discrete data means that is it is arranged in an orderly manner so that is discrete data so yeah we have to arrange the number in ascending order or descending order that is called discrete data and then uh, uh, the thing is uh, the frequency also will come in uh, the discrete data frequency means how many uh, uh, total number of people or total number of uh, fishes represents the data or variable now say x is the class and then frequency f is the frequency then cumulative frequency also we have to take so now the fishes weighing 40 grams the total number of fishes 7 and uh, here cumulative frequency that is it represents 7 total uh, uh, fishes are 7 then here 50 then 6 7 plus 6 that is 30 the cumulative frequency means the previous one and the present one is added that is cumulative frequency 30 60 this is 8 13 plus 8 21 and then 70 70 coming to 16 frequency so 21 plus uh, 16 37 and then 80 89 46 here 46 37 plus 9 that is cumulative frequency then uh, 90 the cumulative frequency is 4, 46 for 450. So this is the cumulative frequency is always called n is equal to 50. Even if you add the frequency, it will come 50. Now the what is the median number for this? That is n plus 1 by 2 is equal to the n is the cumulative frequency is 50. The cumulative frequency 50 plus uh, 51 by 2 51 by 2 is equal to 25.5 so the median will will occur in the place of 25.5 here we have to see the cumulative frequency where the 25.5 fixes it is 21 and here it is uh, that seven. So uh, this is in between these two. So the twenty five point five is in between the twenty one and that some cumulative frequency. Usually the higher frequency we have to take, and then the class represents what that that is the median. So seventy is the median. This is median. Seventy is the median. So like that we have to see. So cumulative frequency that is n plus 1 by 2, 51.2, 25.5, um, uh, the uh, median is coming. Then what we have to do that 25.5, where it fixes? Uh, here it is not 25, 25.5, here it is not 25. So 25.5 fixes in between 21.37. So the highest uh, the highest frequency should be taken. So 37 in that place the frequency represents 16 and the median represents 70. That is the class should be taken as median. So 70 is the answer for this median. Median is 70. So this is with regard to the uh, discrete data. Now we are going to this is uh, uh, for discrete data that is arranged in an orderly way and also the frequency also represented cumulative frequency we have to take and then cumulative frequency divided by 2 that is 
then where it fixes we have to see the highest frequency should be taken and in the place their class should be taken that is median now then the another thing grouped data we have to take the next thing is grouped data grouped data grouped data means we know pretty well that the um, class or the data which we take represent the uh, the class distribution that is the from this one to the that one say we have if at all if we are taking fish say for example 10 to 20 grams fishes weighing and then how many fishes are there that is called frequency and cumulative frequency we have to see like that we have to arrange the order we have to arrange the data in an orderly way or class in an orderly way now x f cumulative frequency so now 50 to 60 40 to 50 40 grams 40 to 50 then frequency is 5 cumulative frequency 5 50 to 60 that is 8 so cumulative frequency 5 plus 8 30 60 to 70 10 13 plus 10 23 then 70 to 80 coming to 15 then this is 38 and then 80 to 90 8 that comes to 46 cumulative frequency 38 plus 8 46 and then 90 to 100 the class interval is 90 to 100 then uh, here 4 46 plus 4 50 so n is 50 cumulative frequency is 50 here cumulative frequency n is equal to 50 now what you have to here we have to apply the formula to find out the median the formula is median is equal to uh, L lower class LC or L we can call it as L uh, then plus within bracket that is uh, N by 2 minus LCF lowest cumulative frequency divided by frequency into class interval this we have to take this is the formula LC is called the lowest class plus N by 2 minus LCF divided by frequency into class interval. Now LC, what is N by 2? First we have to find out N by 2. N by 2 is equal to 50 by 2 is equal to 25. Then, so here we have to find out the uh, N by 2 we have to find out. The N by 2, 25 is false in between 23 and 38. So the 25 falls between so we, this is the highest frequency highest frequency this is uh, lowest community frequency this is called LCF lowest community frequency and uh, the highest frequency uh, highest community frequency uh, represents 15 frequency so the uh, frequency represents 15 F is equal to 15 LCF represent is equal to 23 then class interval 40 to 50 the um, range in between 40 and 50 the class interval that is called class interval that is 10 so these these things we have to write write down all the things what is n by 2 25 so 25 where it fixes it fixes in between 23 and 38 in cumulative frequency the highest frequency should be taken that is called uh, highest cumulative frequency that is uh, 38 and it represents frequency 15 and the lowest class is 70 here the lowest class is 70 and the lowest class also we have to write here lc that is 70 now uh, lowest class is 70 plus that is n by 2 50 by 2 coming to 25 minus lcf 23 
divided by frequency 15 then into class interval 10 so first we have to calculate this then we have to multiply it with 10 and then should be added 25 23 2 2 by 15 it is coming to 2 by 15 uh, or here i will write uh, 2 by 70 plus 2 by 15 into 10 2 by 15 comes to uh, point one one five um, then uh, twenty one fifteen by remaining fifty uh, three one three three like that it will come then into multiply by ten is equal to it will be coming to one point three three then seventy plus is equal to one point three three then what we have to do seventy plus one point three three 70 plus 1.3, 71.33. This is the median. So, median for cumulative frequency. One second to repeat. First, what we have to do, we have to write the um, frequency range or class range in an ordinary way. This may be the frequency, the class range, maybe class interval, maybe according to our uh, suit or uh, standard we can change it it may be even 42.5 and 42.5 to 45 like that even to uh, the class interval maybe we can arrange in any way according to our need it may be for 10 it may be for 15 it may be for 2.5 even it may be for uh, 0.5 like that so we can arrange in any way then frequency we have to write frequency means how many times this data represents the 40 to 50 weighing say for example fish weighing 40 to 50 grams how many fishes five fishes so the cumulative five, five fishes then 50 to 60 grams weighing fishes coming to 8 so 8 plus 5 13 cumulative frequency like that we have to write then the total cumulative frequency coming to 50, 50. the formula is n by 2 lc plus n by 2 lcf divided by frequency into class interval uh, now substituting all the things n by 2 coming to 25 the 25 where it fixes that that is very very important the 25 fixes in between 23 and 38 so the highest frequency 38 should be taken and the in that place the frequency represent that is 15 and in the same place we have to see the lowest class which one either 70 or 80 70 is the lowest so lc now and the lowest cumulative frequency also should be taken that is just above the preceding just above the highest frequency uh, the uh, cumulative frequency is called uh, lowest cumulative frequency everything we have data and then substituting all this with, this, with the formula 70 plus 25 plus, that is minus 23 uh, then divided by 15 into 10 the 25 minus 23 coming to 2 by 15 that will be coming to 1.33 then um, uh, 70 plus 1.33 71.33 it is median is coming to 71.33 if you are uh, uh, group data will be now frequency so median and the center point now group data will be the formula by convert lowest class n by 2 lowest cumulative frequency and then divided by frequency into class interval so substituting all the things then we can find out the median with this we conclude this video